campaign promises versus reality what he says he's going to do and what he actually can do in this video we are going to be talking about trump's agenda day one let's start with the first topic then we're going to have several other topics the first topic is birthright citizenship he says he's going to end the birthright citizenship can he really do that in order to end birthright citizenship you have to amend the constitution is it even easy to amend the constitution trust me it's not easy because that process is designed to be difficult what is birthright citizenship to start with well it's when the person by virtue of being born in the united states can be a u.s citizen just because the person is born in one of the u.s territories that person is a u.s citizen by birth or if one of his parents by the time of birth the parent is a u.s citizen one of them either the mother or the father is a u.s citizen by the time the person is born that person is a u.s citizen by birth and trump says that he's going to end that right in order to do that as i said you have to amend the constitution and in order to amend the constitution you have to get the vote two-thirds of the votes from both the house and the senate can you come up with two-thirds of the votes in your first term not that simple that process is designed to be difficult to avoid arbitrary changes and that's why it is still in the constitution so do not forget that we live in a country of laws and we're gonna go with what is written versus what it is it is says like what people just say they're gonna do you have to remember that during campaigns everybody has to promise something in order to gain votes that's exactly what trump did the strategy fear as a strategy so that people can vote for him in order to maybe protect themselves or something along those lines we don't know but what exactly can be done is different from campaign promises but if you know you are in removal proceedings and you have a case pending you have concerns about your future your immigration future please do not hesitate to contact an immigration lawyer you can contact us as well we're here available to help guide you through your process of becoming a u.s citizen until next time bye bye